Hello and welcome back. We're now going to kind of clean up the rest of this and see if we can find that crystal star. Hmm, I am curious about something. This will probably get me into hot crap, but I'm willing to try. Here we go. Oh no. Yeah, it doesn't work. But that did, give, that did give me a level up though, so I'll take it. I will take it. So now the question is, uh, do I dare do badge power? <laughs> Oh, do I go, like, double down and just keep doing flower power? Oh, man. Yeah, let's make everything 30. Screw it. I think I've been running with 20 flower power since the fourth crystal star, so I think it's best to get that up there. Oh, well, that's unfortunate, but I guess technically I needed to do it. You guys are about to witness me suck horribly at a platformer. <laughs> I always thought I was pretty half-decent at platformers. I guess I was wrong. Oh, look, another ultra shroom. Damn it. Uh, well, I don't have to use any items. So I'm going to say goodbye to this sleepy sheep. Oh, there's a switch. Well, that switch is actually really easy to get to, though. So I should have hit that earlier. I won't lie. So now I got to do all over again. Of course I do. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. I feel so stupid. I thought I was going to stay on the platform if I did that. And that if I went for it, I would have missed it. Oh, now I got to do it a third time. No. Got the final security key. Let's do this. Here we go. Let's go get ourselves a crystal star. <laughs> oh, not this dork again. I have been waiting for you. Oh, man. Oh, man. Have I been waiting? And I hate waiting. You again. You've been waiting, huh? So what? What's that supposed to mean? I'll tell you what it means. I used the crystal star to lure you here. So that I could take all your crystal stars. How brilliant is that, huh? And you want to know the best part? Your little peachy princess isn't even here anymore. So Peach totally isn't here. Where'd you take her, you huge weasel? Buh. Oh my god. That, that, just that frame. What the hell? <laughs> like I tell you the plan. That novice villain style. Wow, they really put a lot of effort into the animation of some of these characters for the sake of, you know, uh, crap. What's the word? I used to, I used the word in my previous parts and I'm blanking. You know what I mean, right? Character, like, emotion. Emotional bandwidth. Ready for showtime? You guys are going to be the perfect workout for Magnus Von Grapple 2.0. All right. I'm going to put my other headphone on ahead of time. Sorry if I'm yelling in the mic because of it. Oh, wow. Flashy. Hope you're up for the challenge, because this thing- Because this thing is raw horsepower, kitties. Oh, wow. What happened to the line of like, Oh, I got the X-Not scientist to jack this thing up like a thousand times or something like that. Unless it's here. Buh. Yeah, last version was buggy, so improvements. One, two, a dozen. Yeah, there it is. I thought it was before. Oh, please. As if we're not going to totally whip you for like the tenth time. <laughs> it's like guaranteed at this point. Ah, Magnus Von Grapple 2.0. The upgraded version of Magnus Von Grapple. 70 HP, 6 attack, and 2 defense. Its basic attack will drill a move that drops from above. It also sometimes releases its fist for flying X punches. 5 HP, 9 attack, and no defense. Yeah, these... This is when things start to really start hitting hard. So me having 30 health is kind of bad. <laughs> But that's why power lift exists. Only three? Damn, I guess bad RNG. I will take it though. Let's see what you got. Here comes suckers. Magnus drill attack. It's gonna leap into the air. Oh, okay. That's unfortunate on my part. All right, you. Actually, wait. I'll just let Mario do all the attacking. Maybe. Do I dare try power bounce? With that one frame input, I'm going to be losing out on a lot of damage. But I've got to try. Oh, now is not the time. Okay, here we go. <laughs> More attack. Here we go. Damn it. Yeah, one frame. One frame. There we go. Yeah, I can't. I can't do it. Like, that did... How much damage did that do? If I'm mathing correctly, that did 26 damage. Now, let's see what a spring jump does with all this bonus attack, if I do it right. Only 22, so it's still better by, like, a few pieces of damage. 
Buh. Time to unleash some of the sweet special features on this bad boy. This is gonna be so good. The fists, yep. Okay, so I lose that one, but that's okay. Let's just do this. Only 10. That's unfortunate. No, how, what? My sweet powered up robots on the ropes. This is wrong. Woo! Alright, so now the question here is... Yeah, I'll just rally wink. Ooh, what am I doing? <laughs> I'll just rally wink. Call it a day. I'm gonna do a spring jump. Because I think it does. It just does more damage. Well, we will about to find out, actually. Here we go. Let's do this. Done. I don't want to fight your boss fight. <laughs> he had so much more up his sleeve. It's such a shame I cheesed him in three turns. Oh my god. Welcome to Broken Goombella at the second stage, ladies and gentlemen. Also, I didn't say much about the music because it honestly sounded like a very similar addition to the one... Grotus. Yeah, it sounded very similar to the one that was um, in the Boggly Woods. That's why I didn't say anything. There he goes. Goodbye, Crump. You will maybe be missed. <laughs> and there it is. Ooh, it's so, like... It's got more color in it because it's kind of rainbowy. Or, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know what the word is. You got a crystal star. You now learn Supernova. What a god... Like, it's it's an amazing uh, star ability. But you do more damage doing power lift than doing your own thing. But we take those. We take those. Three three phase... Only because I had the tattle. Three phase phase boss battle. By the time Mario covered it, Peach has already been taken away. Where could Peach be now? And what of the elusive Grotus? Perhaps he holds the key to the remaining puzzle. Mario finally has all seven crystal stars. Where will they lead him next? To, to the thousand year door to the door that's the friggin point what the hell are you talking about game we're going to the door well we're here now where's that stupid partially saying them crystal stars there right so they say and lo and behold it's there right behind you great about something about time something worked out for all bowser in we go i say i'd like to mount a large animal horn in my foyer to highlight my social status oh my goodness you have terrible fine horns what that's disgusting get away from me creep you can't have my horns <laughs> oh my god She's not scared at all. That's hilarious. Here are the, uh, the bomb bombs. Oh, look. My heart trembles. The fountain so elegant. The art is at its finest. All right, let's open this door. <laughs> I'm wasting enough time here. Darn it. The door is locked. Oh, not anymore. The lock broke. Talk about lucky. Rage really pays off. You have to watch your blood pressure. <laughs> nah, I only kid. Well, I don't kid. Watch your blood pressure, guys. You never know when it's gonna spike. But there it is. A crystal star. Yes, this is it, Haggy. This is finally it. Yay. We got my Mitsu crystal star. Yes. And there's Pennington. You there. I have you now, villains. You common thieves, aren't you? Aren't you? My eyes never deceive. <laughs> what are you implying? I'm no little thief. I am the remorseless king of evil, the shadow thief. Er, Koopa Koot. <laughs> yeah, the Koopa Koot. We'll go with the shadow thief this time. Bowser, the shadow thief. Not a thief, the best thief. I'll be taking this, thanks. <laughs> the shadow thief? I knew it had a scent of no mere burglary. <laughs> You've been hornswoggled, shadow thief, for that is a red herring. A pig. You're not again. But look at that fancy display, the pedestal and everything. It's so posh. If it's a fake, where's the real one? If you must know, I give the real one to Luigi. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You mean to tell me that Luigi beat me here? Ah, those Mario Bros are the most annoying brothers of all time. How bothersome. The fact we keep being outmaneuvered is disturbing. But where in the world can Mario and his brother be heading? Where? Lord Bowser. Aha. Power Goomba. Right on his head. What are you so worked up over? Tell me. Now reporting, sir. And uh, ma'am. Sir and ma'am. Mario's collected the seven crystal stars and is heading for the thousand year door. What in the heck is that? <laughs> An unbelievably legendary treasure is behind that door. Yeah. Then I'm going there too. Immediately. Princess Peach and the legendary treasure will be mine. Cammy, we're leaving now. <laughs> yep. Ah, uh, well done, Luigi. Way not to fail yet. Wherever you are, you may continue to may you continue to triumph. Alright, yep. Yep. This is gonna be fun. Oh yes, right. We solved this part. Awesome. Now we can open the thousand new door. Oh, but we still don't know where Peach is. 
Where could she be indeed? Well, let's head back to Rogueport, right? Professor Frankly can maybe help us find Princess Peach. All right, let's get going. The thing is though, I already activated the teleporter room in the last part, but I'm fairly, I just get this feeling that I have to go downstairs because it's probably not working right now. But you know, for plot purposes. Let's see, yeah, the door's open. Let's go see tech. Oh, there. Where are we? You are Mario, are you not? Yeah. It is pleasant to meet you. I am the main computer of this fortress. I am tech. I must tell you something. That is why I brought you to this place. Princess Peach. Oh, something ain't right with tech. I can tell you that much. I am sorry. Most of my data was erased and my main power unit was shut down. Now I'm running on backup power with only cached memory, trying to stay operational. Mario, you know that Peach is not here, do you not? Please save Peach, please. Is with Grotus heading to the Palace of Shadow. I had to tell you that. Peach is in the Palace of Shadow. Yep. But backup power failing. Mario, use the teleporter room to get back to Rogueport. Teleporter room is on sub-level 2 of the fortress. I'll release the room lock. Please hurry. There's barely enough power left to activate the teleporter. I will cease all functions to send your power to the teleporter. What will happen to you? When the power is all gone, I will cease to exist. But if it will save Peach, I would gladly do this. Because until I met Peach, I knew nothing of love. Damn. <laughs> do not worry about me. I'm just a computer. Just a machine. You must save Peach. Please. And tell her. Ah, yes, this scene. Thank you. For me. Yeah, I could do it. We understand, Tech. So hurry to the teleporter on sub-level 2 now. Save her. Nah, oh, yeah, that's what I do best. That's what I do best. It's not like I haven't been doing this for so long lately. And they had another tip of the hat. We have to save Peach for poor Tech, too. I think I remember where the teleporter room is. I'm about to find out. Oh, now the music's playing. That's cool. I think it's playing for the entire thing. We're about to find out. Yeah, it's for the whole thing. Oh, there it is. The door's just freaking wide open. All right, let's get out of here. Sorry, Tech. We gotta go. <laughs> Off we go. Oh, power dead. Oh, wow. They definitely added additional things here. Peach. Goodbye. Oh, no. Making it really sad. Ooh. The explosion. It wasn't just a ray of light this time. Oh, just like that. Did I hear something a moment ago? No, it was, uh, it was tech, all right. And here we are. Oh, someone bumped into us. Over here, son. Oh, Professor Rankly. You brought the crystal facade back from the moon with you, didn't you? What? Talking to my good ear, the Exnot Fortress was on the moon? Ah, yes. So Princess Peach was there too, I assume. Well, she was, but the Exnot boss took her and headed for the Thousand Year Door. Aha! Just a bit ago, I smelled some rank air and went to the Thousand Year Door. I saw a suspicious fellow and a cape pass through with the other side with Princess Peach. What? No way. Without without all seven crystal stars, the door shouldn't open, though. Believe me, I know, but I'm quite certain of it. I saw it with my own eyes. I have a very bad feeling about this. Very bad. Princess Peach is in danger. Time is short. We must go to the Thousand Year Door and rescue the princess. I'll run ahead and meet you there. Don't dawdle. You must come immediately. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, right. Oh, no. That... Oh, I am going to dawdle. I am going to dawdle. You don't want to, you want to know why I'm going to dawdle? Because my inventory is full <laughs> and I need to do something about it. Okay, I'm calling it a part here. It might be very short due to some various edits that I'm going to make. But, like... I think either the last part was too long or this part's too short. Either way, I don't know. But... Yeah, I'm calling it a part because after this, I'm going, we're going to the Palace of Shadow and it's going to take us either one to two parts to finish up and it's going to be super awesome. I can't wait to see the end of this game. But the thing is, though, there's still so much that I want to do, but I'm not going to do it on camera, of course, because it's going to take too much time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to off screen, just take care of my inventory, get prepared, stuff like that, right? Off camera. And uh, then we'll do the next part. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to hit all the buttons that help me, please and thank you, and be sure to take care of yourselves, alright?